Hey everybody, Rory from ANS Gear. We're looking at Virtue Breakout Knee Pads up on the table today. Just like the elbow pads, there are three available sizes for these knee pads. Now, two of those sizes are a multi-size, and then one is a straight up size. So the small medium is lumped into one size, the large extra large lumped into one size, and then the 2X is its own size right there. This one on the table is a small medium right here. So we're gonna go ahead, pull the card out, and then we'll look at the pad itself. So let's get that out of there. Just like the elbow pads, these are built to win. I like that they put that in there and you slide it out and it says, I'm built to win. Affirmations right there. All right, so these are sided as well. So we've got right and we've got left right there. So when you're picking them up, you know, make sure you're going for the right side. You're not just slapping these on and assuming that they are one side is for either one. So left and right. Machine wash cold, hang to dry. Do not put them in the dryer. I mean, that's pretty typical with all paintball stuff. I don't put any of my stuff in the dryer. Put it in the washer, hang it out to dry. Um, unless it's like towels or things like that, you can throw those in the dryer. But all my gear, my pants, pads, whatever, you can wash them. Just hang them out to dry. All right. So, knee pad, let's get to it right here. So the back of the knee pad is nice stretch material. That's uh, really, really important when it comes to flexibility in areas that need to bend. So like your elbow right here where this bends, you don't want any kind of seam or uh, stitch or anything going on right there that as it bends is gonna grab skin and pinch. That does not feel good. So again, on the back side where your knee is going to be bending like that, the inside or the back of your knee, you don't want any kind of thing right there that's going to bind and pinch the back of your knee. That's not comfortable. So this is just nice, stretchy. Look at the stretch on this stuff. Whoop, whoop, whoop. That's got a lot of stretch right there. It's going to be nice and comfortable when it's on the back of your knee, giving you plenty of stretch. On the top, around your thigh, you do have a Velcro strap. Right here, this strap is elastic, so we can stretch it out and we can wrap it around and make that nice and tight on your thigh. So uh, when it comes to knee pads, it's very important that you have the right size. So what you, even though this has a strap that goes around the thigh, okay, that's gonna help keep it in the right spot. Problem with your thigh though is, for most people, is your thigh tapers down to your knee. So no matter how tight you make this around your thigh, this is always gonna wanna slide down because the thing that it's trying to grip on is not perfectly round, it's tapered. And so this is just through jiggling around and running and stuff, this is gonna wanna scoot its way down your thigh and it happens to everybody. Now, what really holds it up in place is how it goes around your calf. So the calf down here your calf sitting inside this is gonna make it so that it doesn't wanna move down. So always buy your knee pads uh, size specific, if possible, try them on beforehand, if you can. I know that it's an, always an option for a lot of people because a lot of people don't have a shop that's anywhere near them. So try to be as close as you can as far as sizing. Um, the calf, the muscle of your calf is really gonna help keep your knee pads in place. Uh, this does help. I mean, obviously this is gonna secure it up around your thigh, but it's going to move. So don't be surprised uh, if that doesn't sit up there. Make sure the bottom is where it needs to be. Uh, on the front right here, we've got padding that comes around the top. So where the strap is, the padding does run pretty far over. On the knee, we've got really nice thick padding on the inside uh, or the knee section right there. We've got padding that is on the outside plus I don't know if I can get this to, so you can see this. I can turn these inside out, maybe. I can. This whole thing right here is a nice big knee pad as well. So you've got this outside section of padding plus this really comfortable inside section of padding as well right there. Uh, so it's gonna be really nice, really comfortable. These little padding sections you see, that's these sections right here, like this one and these two right here. That's what we're seeing on the inside right here. Nice big knee pad section right there. 
Uh, and then that comes all the way down to the bottom and it still flares out. So this knee pad, your knees right here, they don't just make a little circle and cover like the ball of your knee, if you want to call it, or your knee cap. They continue that pad all the way down. So this is going to go over your lower uh, section of your knee, your upper portion of your shin uh, and cover that right there. Now it's not a gigantic knee pad. It doesn't go all the way down and cover like your ankles or anything like that. It does its job. It's, it's going to protect your knees, which is what you're looking for right there. It's nice and flexible. It's got plenty of um, elasticity to it. So it moves. It's going to be able to conform to your body and move with you and be comfortable at the same time. But it all comes down to really just does it fit you properly. Having the adjustment at the top helps for your thigh, but keeping it from sliding down really has to do with how it fits the lower part of your leg. So try to be specific when you're when you're doing that right there. All right, um, let me go over this list that I've got on here. Lightweight, yes, it's extremely lightweight. Secured strap fitment, we got that along the top right there. Stretch mesh material, this is super important right here. Stretch mesh, it's gonna help uh, with pinching, it's gonna help with breathability, it's going to help with keeping you cool and comfortable and getting that sweat off your body. Contoured fit, flexibility, we talked about the flexibility with it and how it's formed to your kneecap. Abrasion resistant fibers, so it's stitched and made with stuff that isn't going to wear. Now, uh, I would say most people probably are going to be wearing this underneath a pair of pants, but I know a ton of people who play in shorts and just wear their knee pads. Those knee pads are going to take a lot more abuse than knee pads that are underneath uh, a pair of pants. So uh, they've kind of uh, built the durability into it. Uh, and then side impact padded zones. We got impact zones on the side right here, which we talked about. So giving you more than just front knee protection, a little bit off to the side right there. So uh, remember three size options right here, small, medium, large, extra large, and 2X. These are the breakout knee pads from Virtue. Pick yours up today at ansgear.com.